narrated by Shu'ab. I asked Azuri, did the Prophet peace be upon him ever offer the fear prayer? Azuri said, I was told by Salim that Abdullah bin Umar I had said, I took part in a holy battle with Allah's messenger peace be upon him in Najd. We faced the enemy and arranged ourselves in rows. Then Allah's messenger peace be upon him stood up to lead the prayer and one party stood to pray with him while the other faced the enemy. Allah's messenger peace be upon him and the former party bowed and performed two prostrations. Then that party left and took the place of those who had not prayed. Allah's messenger peace be upon him prayed one rake with the latter and performed two prostrations and finished his prayer with taslim. Then every one of them bowed once and performed two prostrations individually. Narrated by Nafi. Ibn Umar said something similar to Mujahid saying, Whenever, Muslims and non-Muslims, stand face to face in battle, the Muslims can pray while standing. Ibn Umar added, the Prophet peace be upon him said, if the number of the enemy is greater than the Muslims, they can pray while standing or riding, individually. Narrated by Ibn Abbas. Once the Prophet peace be upon him led the fear prayer and the people stood behind him. He said Takbir, Allahu Akbar, and the people said the same. He bowed and some of them bowed. Then he prostrate and they also prostrate. Then he stood for the second ruka and those who had prayed the first ruka left and guarded their brothers. The second party joined him and performed bowing and prostration with him. All the people were in prayer but they were guarding one another during the prayer. Narrated by Jabir bin Abdullah On the day of the Kandak Umar came, cursing the disbelievers of Quraysh and said, O Allah's Apostle! I have not offered the Azar prayer and the sun has set. The Prophet peace be upon him replied, By Allah! I too, have not offered the prayer yet. The Prophet peace be upon him then went to Bhutan, performed ablution and performed the Azar prayer after the sun had set and then offered the Makrib prayer after it. Narrated by Ibn Umar When the Prophet peace be upon him returned from the battle of Al-Azab, the Confederates, he said to us, none should offer the Azar prayer but at Bani Qurayza. The Azar prayer became due for some of them on the way. Some of them decided not to offer the salad but at Bani Qurayza while others decided to offer the salad on the spot, and said that the intention of the Prophet peace be upon him was not what the former party had understood. And when that was told to the Prophet peace be upon him he did not blame any one of them. Narrated by Anas bin Malik Allah's Messenger peace be upon him offered the Fajr prayer when it was still dark, then he rode and said, Allah Akbar. Kaibar is ruined. When we approach near to a nation, the most unfortunate is the mourning of those who have been warned. The people came out into the streets saying, Muhammad and his army. Allah's Messenger peace be upon him vanquished them by force and their warriors were killed the children and women were taken as captives. Safi Yah was taken by Dihaya al Kalbi, and later she belonged to Allah's apostle Go who married her, and her mar was her manu mission.